Whoa! There's clearly been some sort of break between this episode and the last, as you may have noticed by the YouTube video ending. Um, I, I think I just ended it off on a very, very minimal note. So uh, that's what's that's what's gonna be, and uh, we're just gonna get back into it. Welcome to the trial, baby. Welcome. All right, let's mess it up. I can't remember what was happening. Yo. Despacito gonna die right now. Where is the baby gravy sword? Right here. And where's the pea sword? <laughs> right here! And I rip off my testicles and balls. Ligamus. Oh, wait, Despacito, what do you mean? Ligamus. <laughs> Lig ligamus. Ligaments. All my ligaments. Mmm. We'll suck my lip in there. Hello, Skuma. Hello, Despacito. How's it fucking going? Anyway, let's do this. Yeah, that sounds like a seesaw, right? That's right. Last time we found out someone just fucking sent it onto that floorboard to fucking kill Tenko. Um, which is pretty fucking hilarious. Right now, uh, there's been some speculation on who it is. I can't remember. If I, 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 don't, I don't know. I'll let you come up with it yourself. I've already got my master fucking, my mastermind available. Ah, Despacito, your favorite fucking game. Dang and Ropa. And Bunky, hello! You got feelings in your teeth. Oh, yeah, that's right. I remember you saying that. All right, anyway. I probably, it's already been a minute and 30 seconds. Haven't even started playing the game. Fuck you guys. <laughs> they couldn't have killed Tengo like that. Unless they use the sickle. Also, hello, Bunky. How's it fucking going? You got feelings, eh? Mmm. Tenko was the one who hated men. <laughs> she was like the Aikido master. They could have Tenko like that unless they used the sickle. That's exactly it. Using the seesaw trick, it was possible to kill Tenko with a sickle. Yeah, bruh. They just slammed her head up into that oh. ceiling, bro. In order for the culprit to kill Tenko with a seesaw trick, the placement of the sickle is the most important factor. How'd they place it, bro? How'd they do it? The floorboard, seesaw, the cage, and the blood on the white fabric. What conclusions can I draw from this? There's only one place the sickle could have been that is consistent with the evidence. Where was the sickle when Tenka was killed? Next to the cage, under the floor, at the top of the cage. Between the victim and the floorboard. Top of the cage, baby. That's right. No, that's it! Tenko did. I didn't mind Tenko near the end. With the blade she was all right. Angie was a fucking god. That was a blessing. Thank you so fucking much, Atua, for smiting your fucking servant. How's it fucking going, Virgilos? Seesaw. The sickle was at the top of the iron cage with the blade facing down. Was she the one who was talking about God? Angie was the one talking about God. She's also dead, actually. She got murdered first. Tenko just got caught up. She got murdered for no reason, essentially. She died for nothing. <laughs> we'll just leave it at that. Um. The reason we didn't see it was because of the fabric covering the cage. But who could have put the fabric on? Oh yeah, the dog was holding also, it down. The wooden statue. Kept they killed the Tenko when she was place. getting to be a good character. Oh my god! And I was thinking that I was like, oh, she's kind of getting a redemption arc. And I was like, nah, she's gonna fucking die. She's like, I'll go under the fucking sussy little cage in this fucking seance. And I was like, sick, sick, sick. It's true that the sickle's handle was thick, which made the statue wobble. But the statue's weight kept it from falling over. You heard Once that little everything belch. was in place, if you stepped hard enough on the seesaw... I seesaw! Tenko's body would have shot upward and hit the blade on the top of the cage. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how it could not be Korokio, because he's the one who fucking masterminded all this. She was killed by r slash atheist. <laughs> She was like, actually, uh, <laughs> she was like, actually, Fundy, uh, I'm good. Just thinking, keep thinking my friend being transformed. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> oh, oopsie fucking poopsie. Hope that fucking works out. Shit, I'm sorry. That's, uh, oh, man. Meaning the sickle's blade would have connected with her neck. That's a little fucking gross. What you gonna fucking do? The six-inch sickle yeah. blade wasn't Wait, long enough that. to stab Tenko in her crouch position. But with my fat fucking ass, it certainly was. Let me just plug my phone in. Sorry. Short moment. Short moment, please. Smexcellent. All right. Well, I'm really sorry, Virgil. That 110 fucking percent fucking sucks.
Life's just always on the up. I like how they always calling it a seesaw just feels like is there a more refined Is there like a more seesaw synonyms? Cause seesaw <laughs> sounds so seesaw! Waver, teeter board, teeter, yaw, vacillate, straight, tilting board. Yeah, it's hard. It's hard to say anything but seesaw. Ouchie. <laughs> Oopsie. A boo boo six inch blade. Wanna know what else is six inch? My fucking bagel. That's a pretty big fucking bagel. <laughs> that streamer does not know what six inches is. Is that a big, is how big is that bagel? That's a, that's a sizable bagel from like here to from here to the edge of this fucking ruler. That's a huge bag. That's a big bagel. It's like a Kaiser bun, motherfucker. <laughs> oh wait, I gotta get ready actually. Let's just fucking, uh... <laughs> so. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And there we go. Call it a yeehaw. All right, fuck it, I'll call it a yeehaw. But the floorboard acting is a yeehaw! It will compensate for the blade's length. Bringing the victim to the sickle rather than bringing the sickle to the victim. Bro, That's spit it. That's definitely an unorthodox idea. What the fuck? Spit it. Spit. No, stop. I'm getting fucking bullied. <laughs> I stopped paying her. She's mad now. That's a sizable basil. Thanks, Shin. <laughs> God fucking damn it. I didn't know we were talking about that! Can you imagine eating that much of a bagel? A six inch bagel. Sorry, I wasn't talking to you. I was talking to them actually. That's too big. That's what she says. It's definitely an unorthodox idea. Fuck, she's being murdered right now. Tenko's fucking being murdered and you're laughing. You're laughing about the size of my fucking bagel. I'm still timed out for an hour on Lexus's street. Lexus, get ready. Now to be timed out. Shit! He's coming. So the sound we heard, alright, I fucking missed what what's his nuts said. Uh so the sound, wait, it's crazy. Explain how Tenko got stabbed in the cage. So the sound we heard was the cur culprit stomping on the floorboard. Make floorboard come loose. Probably, dude. I, I don't know. I'm not too sure myself. Looks like we got ourselves a good old fashioned seesaw homicide. <laughs> of course she'd say homicide. Homicide? Why the fuck would you say it like that? What the hell's a seesaw? <laughs> what, what, what's the, what's with the switch up? <laughs> Looks like we got ourselves a good old fashioned seesaw homicide. What the fuck? Wait, what the hell's a seesaw homicide? That's fucking crazy! You fucking say it weird, Miu. It makes crazy sense for me to really say it like that. Game fun, you know? Yeah, I guess so. They can't get away with murder the normal way, so they gotta think outside the box. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. Kudos, culprit. You did a great job keeping me entertained. Indeed. Well played, Himiko. What's up? Oh, he's trying to fucking be like, Himiko did it. That sneaking, that conniving little magic bitch. And then we're all like, no, it couldn't have been her. It's like, isn't she annoying, though? Wouldn't you like to see her dead? And we're like, oh, that's, that's a pretty good point. She's like, yeah, wait. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I can't fucking wait for Himiko to die during a class trial and her be like, what a pain, before they drop the uh, fucking ridiculously large anvil onto her, splattering her guts and blood everywhere. Yeah. That's what I'm fucking excited for. <laughs> it was you. Oh, no, no, no! The one behind uh, us. No, I fucking <laughs> fucked that up. <laughs> what? What happened? It was you, wasn't it? The one behind the seesaw homicide. I thought I'm sorry, I skipped ahead. Homicide. <laughs> Why homicide? Because she's the only one capable of carrying out this plan. Bruh, literally no. The only one? Why is that? Because this seesaw homicide required its location to be prepared beforehand. By cutting the cross piece beneath the floorboard, you mean? Then the culprit would need to lure their victim into the prepared room. That is why you chose that room for the seance. Is it not, Himiko? I mean, he makes a good point. I'm interested to see how he's going to weasel his way out of this. <laughs> Himiko just made a doofy, doofy car. Mm, however, I have three empty rooms. Which one shall we use? Um, the middle room? The middle room's always best for stuff like this. Oh, yeah. Himiko was the one who chose the site for the seance. Mmm. 
You know what? Let's call it here. Let's not make the trial go any further. We're already all sus on Himiko. I say we just fucking murder her and then I'll die as well in the process. That's just my vote, personally. When the streamer mistakes the same game as Elden Ring for the Tenzin. <laughs> what a silly fucking streamer. <laughs> what a goofy fucking streamer. I'm gonna... Um... I'm gonna keep making Elden Ring jokes. I should have made a Lego Star Wars. <laughs> That's the new meme. That's the new fucking meme. I should have just made it. Uh, I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> how's it going, Baba? How's it going? When's your? Do you get your? Did you get your fucking uh, marks back from your goddamn car lesson? You fucking motherfucker! How'd it go? I don't know if you did. Anyway, Himiko was the one who chose to site for the seance. You don't fucking say. Himiko goes. She likely found out about my plans for the seance somehow. Yeah. You were quite vocal about the seance, Kyo. You even had instructions for it in your lab. <gasps> Wait a minute. Our culprit, Himiko prepared her seesaw trap ahead of time. Then she waited for me to host the seance and suggested the middle room. She led us all into holding the seance right where she wanted it. Then There have been no results Echo. yet. I don't know what the all fuck the they're doing. <laughs> they just fucking lost them. They're like, ah, fuck it. All right. <laughs> Give them a full license. Why not? Mm-hmm. Mm that's a lie, right? The Himiko did such a thing? Could she have? I don't know. I was thinking about Kingdom Hearts 4. I thought of an entire ass scene or something like that happened. I will die from peak comedy. Fucking comedy. Seven Mickey Mouses? Seven Mickey Mices? <laughs> Ridiculous! In the end, Himiko, who Tenko cherished and loved, tragically killed. Wait, we don't know that, right? Shut up, Gonta, we already do. <laughs> you don't want to kill Himiko, right, huh? Himiko, Are you the sussy Himiko one? Would never kill Tanko, right? I don't know, probably not. Tanko? <laughs> Watch this just do a fucking full reverse, so she just snaps and goes fucking psycho, and she's like, I did it! Korakio, make it Koraki. <laughs> Koraki, we making things up to cover his fucking guilt. I don't trust that bitch. I agree, Bunky. He's a fucking sussy baka. Yeah, did you? Himiko? What's wrong, Himiko? Uh, my character development, it's so sh- I'm, I'm so fucking sorry. All the Himiko fans out there, uh, I want to apologize that you have such shit taste. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm just fucking around. Is it true that Himiko's using the, the middle room as Himiko's idea? Is that fucking really- does that mean- does that really mean that they fucking- Himiko fucking ended it all? Himiko's full Dragon Ball used the spirit bomb. She actually is magical. She just fucking like turns Ki- uh, Korakio inside out. We're all like, OH FUCK! And then she just fucking goes crazy. Will something like that really happen? Something so cruel. Nah, Himiko's- Himiko's alright. She's like- Angie was definitely- I definitely want Angie to die. That was just like- that was fucked up. I really just did want her to die. Tenko, I was like, yeah, she, you made a good point, Virgil. She was, like, on the way up of getting some development besides hating men. <laughs> I'm sort of fucking... So tell me a little bit something about yourself. I hate men. Is this going to be a Dragon Ball? Is this the Spirit Bomb? Bad anime memes has been replaced with fucking... I keep watching the ones with fucking... With fucking, uh... I keep watching the ones with, um... The Breaking Bad instead. <laughs> I don't want to save. I think I just did. This is the save, right? Yeah. So you're good. All right. Whoa! Well, Monokuma and Cub Cedar. Looks like we've reached the intermission segment, which means it's time for our Guess the Victim Quiz! A victim quiz? Not a culprit quiz? The only victims are the people who are still watching this drawn out, boring crap. Why are you being such a downer all of a sudden? It's okay. It is okay. I am sure everyone is happy. <laughs> Kairi Riku, do you know how? Do you know Sterliza? Riku, who Sora? Oh, I live with your Kairi who Sora. Uh, Sterliza, Kairi who she? Sora, my roommate. Kairi, who is that? I love the DB standing there. <laughs> wow! Oh <laughs> yeah, Bob. <laughs> When you go to the fucking, when you go to the, the DMV and ask what your fucking results are. Oh, wow! I am sure everyone is happy. How do you know?
my goofy mom. Goofy mom setting up the car alarm by smacking on the hood with her fucking bare hands again. Ugh. How do you, how do you know? They could be skipping the entire conversation for all you know. Oh, that's funny. It is Monotaro. <laughs> Ban Virgil for not understanding. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> right, anyway. Monokuma is the knowledge this series sucks. I can't take it anymore. I'm the real victim here. Me! Why are you getting upset? What is this Mickey Mouse fucking shit? If anything, I'm the real victim. I gotta put up with all this nonsense all the time. Hot take, but Dragon Ball Z Broly is the cooler Broly. You know what? I'm willing to accept that hot take. I'll be honest with you, Despacito. I'll, I'll, I'll be honest with you. That's the right answer, Mono Dom. Why? He hasn't said anything. Exactly, because there are no victims. Yep, even if you're killed in this killing game, you're a winner. Because then everyone mourns you and you get tons of posthumous popularity. Posthumous. Makes sense, Despo likes the whiny baby character. Mickey Kuma. <laughs> mono. Mono Kuma Clubhouse. Mono. Mono. Mono Kuma is on the no fly list. Oh, Daddy, you need to reveal these kind of behind-the-scenes details. Right. Dying makes you more popular, and we gotta die soon, too! Mm. A threat that will be lived up to. I think Mono Fanny is gonna be the last one. Mmm. Gulp. Mmm. This is my impression of a spooky, scary gulp. Uh -huh. I'm fine with real ghosts, but impressions of them are too scary! Apologize. How's the slurping going down there in chat? Can you guys hear it? Uh, did you hear something? What is his problem? What is up with Monotaro recently? No, I didn't hear anything. You know what else is scary? Fuck the movie up. Sweet entire fu we get an entire fucking movie with this the decrepitly small old man not even a single shot of his full frontal nude cock and balls like what honestly is that fucking logic i gotta ask i gotta ask the developers like what the fuck is up with that so round so sweet so delicious all right, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I'm not gonna mute the mic for some reason while I slurp up the rest of the smoothie. So just fucking get ready for it, okay? I don't know why I'm like this. Okay, three, two, one. Hey, <sighs> <sighs> SMR, Bunky's like, fuck yeah! <laughs> fuck yeah! <laughs> Slurpy. I should get the one where it's like the fucking like pod, the plastic one. Anyway, this trial, we're 20 minutes in. This trial, this trial is going fucking nowhere. It's gonna take the rest of the stream. You're watching on YouTube right now. You're like, maybe it's gonna make it through in the next couple episodes. We start this one. You're like, there's no fucking hope. There's no fucking hope. It's gonna be the next fucking seven episodes. Losing viewers. That doesn't sound scary at all. All right, well, let's get into this. Yeah, Mono Tom, me oh, too. Did you hear something? No, I didn't hear anything. Oh. They miss him. Is he a ghost now? Alright, Himiko, what's up? Answer us, Himiko. Yeah, bruh. You chose the middle room to lure us into your trap, did you not? Probably. Then you used that trap to kill Tenko, yes? Uh, well, donkey lips, <laughs> did you kill that twat? <laughs> the aggression, the aggression on that fucking line hit of twat. <laughs> also has a better ah. Wait, must be some mistake. No way, Himiko is culprit. Then she needs to defend herself. Otherwise, this debate is deadlocked. Okay. I don't care if you got to use magic to do it, but say something already. Are you even listening? No, I'm not listening. <laughs> Nani? I, I don't care anymore. I'm too tired. <laughs> Kenji died. Tanko died. 
Why did I have to survive? <laughs> she just wants to die too because uh, she wants to be out of this fucking world. <laughs> Corky was like, all right, the six, six, six. Okay, let's do it. Suspect isn't into it. That's not the problem. Damn it! Don't tell me you've given up. Don't tell me you've given up, fucking sugar Himiko, lips. Don't give up. Donkey, 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 dick, sugar lips, Himiko. <laughs> don't you understand? My life is riding on the outcome of this trial. Just shut up. I told you, I'm too tired. Okay. That's a fair point. It's all just a big pain. I can't put up with it anymore. What are you talking about? If you give up here... You needn't worry. Himiko was the one who chose that room. Therefore, she is unmistakably the culprit. Impossible! Himiko would never kill Tanko! Himiko, not that kind of person. Gota can tell by Himiko's face. <laughs> nice. Yeah, okay. Himiko nice face. Yeah, thank you, Gota, for the so fucking factual evidence. <laughs> I also think Himiko's not the culprit. Um, somehow. <laughs> fucking, sorry. I just kind of miss <laughs> her just fucking fully of calling her that she's fucking stupid. We need more evidence. Either I way, fucking... I know they're kind of they're kind of like they're kind of like fucking like yeah she definitely fucking did it she chose the room and no one's thinking that like oh Korokio literally fucking set up the entire situation I guess you're kind of in the midst of things I'll give them I'll cut them some slack no it's not we gotta be strong gotta keep thinking then we might find new truth yeah Gonta so no give up Himiko Himiko, I know how you feel. I felt the same way after Kaede died, and I looked down at my cum-covered hands. But we can't give up. If we survived. We can't give up for the sake of everyone who died. All right, here we fucking go. <laughs> Himiko's like, I'm gonna fucking kill myself. The cage child sound during seance. Yeah. Uh huh. Was Himiko's decision was it not? What if someone steered her into picking that room? Of the three empty rooms. Let's see, wait, hold on. In order to a child, you need five people, including the spirit medium, at a dark place, no light. Da, 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 da. All right. Well, lie, 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 lie. Okay. Why did you select the middle one? Bloody Kokichi? Was Trap only in that room? Other rooms may be trapped too. Yeah, even if Himiko picked the room, someone else could have set that trap. Yeah, bro. Your opinions are empty words. <laughs> nice defense, Himiko. Very sick. If the culprit's plan were to make Himiko a suspect, then they might have made the same trap in other rooms as well. There must be some evidence that supports that idea. Ah, oh, okay, yeah, bloody Kokichi. All right. Okay. So it's got to be. It's but it's definitely about the bloody Kokichi. I wonder if, uh, if because I'm on the easy mode, they make those fucking hints at the end of like the, the, um, the whatever debate more obvious. Um. Timiko's decision was it not? Okay. I feel like it's that one. Of the three empty rooms, why did you select the middle one? Because you laid your trap there. Mm, okay. Was trapped only in that room? What's well, like it's a uh, room? Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, even if you don't the room. Oh whoops. Someone else is this that trap. Uh, is this is it a, is, is this a live one? Sound during seance? Bloody Kokichi. <laughs> The fucking Broly discussion going on in chat. All right, I is this a lie one? It feels like they're. I don't know which one I would lie on, honestly. I'm. I'm. I feel like I've got it that it's like. Whoops! All right, fire that up. Oh shit! I almost fucking locked it off. My sources say yes. Okay, I'll try lying with that one, and if that doesn't work as a lie, we'll see. We'll see if I fucking. Yeah, she's a savage little toad. I just saw that. 
other rooms may be trapped too. I don't know. Fuck it. Let's go. Nah, it didn't work. We only investigate the middle room. There's nothing we can do about that now. I have a question. Why not kill Shuichi? He's gonna figure everything out. Without him, everyone would fall to pieces. That's fucking true. Just fucking murder Shuichi. Why don't you just murder yourself, Shuichi? Plus, we need to stomp the floor by the other rooms to be sure. I was wrong. That made a mistake. Fuck. Oh, whoa. Where's all my fucking health? What the fuck did I do? Oh, you know what? Backroots are lies on debates that have a truthful answer. Ah, fuck. All right. Ooh. That, well, I didn't mean to do that. Ah, fuck! I didn't mean to hit it. Ah, the one fucking time I don't, I fucking suck balls. I can't believe this. Oh fuck you! Oh shit. Okay, that didn't work either. Oh, so you can't deny Broly was more. <laughs> okay, that's D correct. The one who says he's in the middle room was Himiko, wasn't it? Ah, I made a mistake. I'm gonna fucking lose this game because I suck fucking balls. Oh, damn, I made too many fucking mistakes! Do they think I did it? Oh, oh. Hmm, done debating already? Everyone's got off the Himiko train and now thinks Shuichi's a fucking piece of shit? Well, this next part's mandatory, so let's get it over with. It's voting time! Is this Is it really what? over? Uh, man, I... Oh, do I... Can't I can't let here. it fucking end like this. Please tell me it does not take me back to a long time. Okay, just this fucking debate. Thank Christ. All right. Sound during seance. Bloody Kokichi. All right, let's look at the evidence. There's a loud sound. Bloody, uh, let's look at Bloody Kokichi. Um... Okichi was investigating the neighboring room where there was a sand, so he stepped in one of the floorboards. That room also had a part of the cross piece cut off, the portion that supported the floorboard. I don't know which one. Me lurky! Sounds like a fucking plan, Lexus. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for fucking. I appreciate it. Good luck. Have fun. Kill those guilty suckers. I will absolutely fucking murder as many as I can, Lexus. <laughs> Trigger. <laughs> I think the auto mod just fucking hates you. I'll do it. I don't know. I didn't know what to. I don't know. I didn't know how to lie. I couldn't lie to Gonta, sweet boy. I didn't know which one to lie on there. What the? Oh. Each room was the same. They were all trapped. I don't know. What? Is that true? Bro, probably. Yeah. Oh. It's a sleepy. He was way too careless. Uh, wait, what are you talking about? You had to lie to Sumugi? Sumugi? Did she say anything? Did Sumugi say anything? Was it that one? What if someone steered her into picking that room? Oh, really? Oh, fuck. Oh, whoopsie. <laughs> With the cage child bullet. Fucking moron! Ah, fuck. All right. Well, shit. I mean, I could just fucking load it. Let's see what happens. Oh, fuck, I Let's see what. I, I do like the backward dialogue. Tiger, guess how many timeouts I have? Uh -huh, one more. <laughs> just fucking. <laughs> Scoob I fucking ruined it too. I ruined just whatever amount of timeouts he had. On timeout, I. <laughs> 118. How many timeouts do you have, Scuba? Let's, uh... What was that? Intermission? Class trot? Sure, let's load it. Fuck it. Alright, I don't know if we'll fucking remember to cut all this out. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. I'm just kidding. He's gone. I think he fucking left. What the cage... No, I didn't do that. I didn't do the cage bullet one, actually. One more. We fucking reached this garbage. And I actually am ironically skipping through this. <laughs> All the fucking noises. It's like Johnny Test. <laughs> I have 901, you ass, but now it will change. <laughs> Alright, Annie. Let's fucking go. I don't give a shit about him. Go. Fuck you. Alright. You chose why your dick is so small. Nice, good, cool, very nice. <laughs> All the fucking noises. Alright, here we fucking go. Alright, I'm gonna fucking lie. I'm gonna get an A plus on this fucking trial.
The Cajun Child. Performing the seance in that room. All right, fuck you. Decision, was it not? I don't know. Probably not. What if someone steered her into picking that room? <laughs> oh, oh god damn it! I fucking missed it. Metal pipe hitting <laughs> floor sound. <laughs> Fucking Wilhelm scream. <laughs> yeah, Shlimiko. Yeah, Shling Shlong over here picked the fucking room. Wow, there must be some fucking evidence that I'm not stupid. All right. Was Himiko's decision was it not? Fuck! Fuck! Are you fucking kidding? I was one fucking centimeter off. God fucking damn it! Go talk it down! Go talk! They got machine guns on the fucking floor! Get down! Look out! Look out! Look out. They might have fucking done fucking shit. How the fuck did I like randomly fucking hit it that one time and then I absolutely get fucked the next? Fuck you, Sumigi. I'll fucking lie! I <laughs> like the jizzing sound. If implicating Himiko is a plan, then disrupting that plan might teach us something. For that reason, I have to lie. Well, I mean, you don't have to lie, but uh... I believe Himiko was being set up. Himiko only picked that room because Kyo wanted it as dark as possible. <gasps> what? I want a room that's as uh, no. In order for the caged child to suck, the room must be as dark as possible. My lab has windows, so even with the lights off, it is still not dark enough. <laughs> then what about the empty rooms? Even if Himiko did choose an empty room because of what Kyo said, are you saying she chose the middle room by pure coincidence? The culprit gambled on the middle room being picked through coincidence. I don't know. What that are the odds on that? Improbable. One out of four. I like to be in the universe where Shuichi is a compulsive liar. <laughs> Shuichi just fucking lies about everything. In the end of the fucking game, I hope it just gets you the, like the worst ending where he's like, she's like, what should I do? Am I innocent? And he's like, fucking lies about it, and everyone just fucking dies. No, that is true. The culprit wouldn't have left that to chance, but maybe they didn't. Perhaps they manipulated Himiko somehow. However, there are three empty rooms. Which one shall we use? I'm the middle room. The middle room's always best for stuff like this. Oh my God. Wait, she's just an idiot. No more. <laughs> I told you, it's too much of a pain. Just do the voting or whatever. I go blowy brainsy out now. Haha, <laughs> 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 and it makes this noise when her fucking the bullet rips through her skull. Should we see Kukichi just being buds in this timeline? <laughs> just fucking lying. Hi, Maiko. I'm pretty sure it didn't matter which room Himiko chose. What do you mean? It's getting kind of boring, so I'll explain. I didn't choose the middle by coincidence. Each room was the same to begin with. Each room? Same? Same? Remember what Gonta said earlier? Maybe the culprit placed traps in all the rooms? Well, So far away from 69k correct. points. Before the trial, I hurt myself checking all the rooms. You can, uh... You could just invest invest in the dividend system that I have going. Just pay me money and That's right. Ugh, that's fucking right. I guess there was no cross piece supporting this floorboard, so I kinda stepped through. My face when Kukichi is the one that tells the truth. <laughs> what bad luck. Kokichi found another loose floorboard in one of the other rooms. Oh. Well, I didn't find it so much as I stepped through it and tripped. Whoa, hold on. There was also a loose floorboard in the next room? Yeah, yeah. Can, let's keep up, Tsumigi, all right? It's all good. I, you can do this. I shit you fucking not. I was wondering. No one's done it for a while, actually. All right, fuck you, Virgil. So the culprit put a trap in all three empty rooms, not just the middle one. The culprit set traps in all the rooms, mm -hmm. and they wouldn't need to select a room themselves. So the real trap was for someone else to pick a room and take the blame. <gasps> oh, Korakio. 
What's that sussy look on your face for, my guy? I see. We were caught in the culprit's trap all along. Oh, what a good reversal, you little Especially fuck. You. Why did I spend points? But now there's Goofy no reason guy. to suspect Himiko, right? I guess. I still want to suspect her, though. I'm still going to vote for her, honestly. Tenko. Do you remember what Tanko told you? Keep your chin up and live like fish and fires if I were being everyone else. Please. Live yeah. facing forward. Yeah. She said that to you, right? Yeah, that's right. If you give up on living, you'd be betraying her memory. Yeah. You should vote for him and go. I fucking wish. <laughs> I should fucking do it. <laughs> this Oops. trial. It's not just for our lives. It's for everyone who's died as well. That's why we can't give up. This is our responsibility. We live on. <laughs> right. Yeah, that's right. Is it? If I gave up here, I wouldn't be able to face Angie or Tinko. That's right. So let's do our best. <laughs> oh. Okay. I'm not going to say it's a pain anymore. <laughs> yeah. We go looks at the voting board and goes, yeah, votes for herself. <laughs> Do not say everyone. After all, the blackened is still among us. <laughs> hey, there you go. Killing the mood like usual. But damn, well said, Shuichi. That's what I'd expect for my soul, bro. My soul, bro. Damn, side chick to soul, bro. Do I still get some of that top, that sloppy toppy kind of emota? I'm just having an interesting and different main character. I like you know, as I like. Well, I, don't know, I lost my thing. Your soul, bro. Well, anyway, do you think the blackened this time has some sort of superpower? Pooper power? What are you talking about? <laughs> Superpowers. Well, as a self-proclaimed expert of stepping through floorboards, isn't it weird that no one stepped through that floorboard before the culprit used it? Bro, the circle, dude. Uh, yeah, that's true, actually. That is a good point. <laughs> He's like, he's like trying to think. He's like, fuck, 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 fuck. Isn't it weird that this happened? Yeah, that is kind of weird, isn't it? That Among Us line, I have to, it has a, it has, because I, uh, you know, I'll, I'll hit it. I'll set one, three, two, one. So I have to fucking, I have to fucking, <laughs> I have to fucking hit it beforehand. I just fly into my soundboard. Kamaro is the only interesting main character. Yeah, you know what? I hate to break it to everybody, but uh. <laughs> must have been barrier magic. All right, you've done your part of the trial, Himiko. You can just, you can honestly just shut the fuck up now. Well, that's one possibility, but I think it might have been something else. Why didn't no one step on the Fleur Bird until it was used for the murder? He has Among Us vision. <laughs> I am the Red Crewmate. I just always got on standby. Ugh, that's it. That must be the raisin. Oh, fuck. What did I fucking do? Why did no one step on the floorboard until... It yeah, okay. It's definitely the fucking... Is it... Um, oh, oh, my fucking god. Okay, let's do that thing again. Um, I'm gonna say it was. I, I will do this. this is it. Okay, cool. Mm. I have a mogus vision. At the scene of the crime. I have pattern recognition. <laughs> I see the words among us. I see a trash can with a red, red paint and a silver lid. Also, it's dark in here, so be sure to watch your step. If the magic circle is broken, not only will the seance fail, not only will Skuma's power be realized, but it may also unleash a curse. Whoa, I fucking made it. Fuck you, Virgil, you piece of shit. <laughs> He's on a phone call. Can't talk back. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> the crewmates. <laughs> what is? I want to see what the fucking. 
What is this in the Skype? In the what is the red crewmate in in the Skype? Let's see. Skype, missing. Closed book emot Closed book on Skype emoticons. Oh, it just looks like that. <laughs> Look. Wait a minute. Wait a goddamn second. All right. Seems normal so far. But when I do a few calculations, it's <laughs> fucking terrible. It looks like shit. I should probably flip it back, shouldn't I? Before I fucking forget and try to sew people, sew people, try to fucking show people this. All right, there you go. Is that right? Yeah, that's that's right. Okay. Anyway, but back we go. Angie's dead, I guess. Oh, no, it's the other one. The floorboard in question was in the circle. That's why no one stepped on it. Oh, that's right. The circle's purpose was to keep us away from the whole trip. <gasps> that was part of the culprit's plans, too? Uh, m m maybe. I'm going insane. <laughs> Mom, please. Mom, emergency meeting. Emergency meeting. Someone drank all the... Someone found the piss drawer. That's right. If that's the case in the culprit, there's no doubt in my mind. They're the one who killed Tenko. Only one person had the opportunity and the motive. Himiko, it really was you. You know it's not me. There's no time to mess around. Oh. Someone's staring at me. I screwed up. They think I'm a fucking fraud. Ah, oh, well, this time I'll get it, though. <laughs> That's fucking worth it. That's big boy worth it. <laughs> was it you? He's like, no. <laughs> That's it. The culprit killed the victim. <laughs> the fucking culprit. Mm, whatever are you talking about? Talking about? We're talking about a murder. Have you? Do you have you been listening? We're talking about a murder case. I'm talking about Tenko's murder. Yeah, dude. Have you not been paying attention this entire time? Kyo? Why do you suspect me? Because you were the one who drew the magic circle. The circle kept us from discovering the seesaw trick. But that's not all it was for. In order to make the murder succeed, Variables like Tenko's position and the placement of a cage needed to be defined. I like how they have extra dialogue for those choices. Yeah, literally. They're like, no, you fucking moron. <laughs> just say it was fucking... <laughs> Someone just not related to the case at all this time. Be like, whoa, whoa what? <laughs> say it was Angie. And those variables were defined by using the magic circle. In short, the circle itself the magic was the most important tool in this murder. <laughs> Knowing that, the person who drew the magic circle has to be the culprit. Well, Kyo. Answer already! Did you do it? <laughs> oh my god, I fucking. <laughs> him... <laughs> yeah, bro. What's so fucking funny, bro? What's so fucking funny? No! Listen, bro. That's why your mama dead. Dead as hell. Your grandmammy, too. What is so funny? I don't know. I was just thinking. <laughs> I was just thinking about one of Shiny Doorknobs' classic fucking vine boom bits. <laughs> so this is how each blackened must have felt. What an intriguing experience this is. Wait, so we got him? What? An intriguing experience? Yes, I am erect. the culprit as you claim, then I stomped on the floorboard, yes? Yeah, bruh. So... Do tell. Okay. How could I have stomped on the floorboard during that darkened seance? You got sick ass night vision, bro. See, that is problem. <laughs> Unless that is made clear, you cannot be certain I am the culprit. 
How can you be so calm when you're backed into a corner like this? He ate like a lot of carrots. I will explain that in due time. Please answer my question first. <laughs> the culprit stepped on that exact floorboard, even in the fartness. Lord Hal, how did they move around in total darkness? How do they? In a room that dark, it's hard to imagine the culprit found the right floorboard. Although even after I put out the candle, I could move along the wall with my hand. Wait a minute. Maybe. Thank God, Shuichi, please just fucking fo solve this one Did for me, buddy. That's it. No, the culprit didn't even have to see at all. They used... How did the culprit hearing, touch, smell? Six cents! Touch? Mer Mervamon fan 14? Thanks for the follow. I fucked this up. Oh shit, no I didn't. Alright, I did good. Thanks for the follow, motherfucker! Mervamon fan. They didn't see. Mervamon fan 14. Thanks, motherfucker. Thanks for the follow. Really fucking appreciate it. Oh wow, wow, so sussy. Look at this fucking go. The culprit used touch. They didn't see it. They fucking fell. Like how I got to the candle. What a weird... Why did they... Uh, Alright, you know what? Fair the fuck enough. In middle of room? Gonta doesn't think it was near wall. Don't just shut up, bro. Yeah, we just gotta kill Korakio. Something besides the wall to move then, right? Hmm? Were there any other markers within reach? Of course, the answer to that is... There was nothing of the sort. No. I'm sure there was something. Um... Fuck, I don't know. A landmark they could have used to determine where the floorboard was. It must have been at the scene. I know it. What the fuck? I don't know which one it is. Hangman's Gambit. Oh, no. Oh, this isn't good. Oh, gee, that's wrong. I'm gonna die. Stone marker? M-A-R-K- Uh... Uh, magic something, magic circle. Okay. No, that was wrong. Fuck, I thought I could, thought I could get that shit. Nice, magic gluck gluck. I missed all of those. Magic s cisgendered male. All right. Sir, oh fuck, is that an R? No, nope, I, I can't tell. No, it's all the same. Okay. Sir. Co. It's gotta be an I L in there somewhere, right? No. Okay. There's an E. That's an E right there. I. Was it one? Any of these an L? I feel like I. It's just. Am I? Am I dumb? Am I doing this the wrong way? Okay. I got to eat. There you go. Woo! <laughs> Good morning, everybody on headphones. Hi, Madinga. Oh, yeah, that's they the guy. The magic circle. That's the guy from famous uh, three lane um, multiplayer online battle arena, uh, Dota. That's it. The magic circle. They use the magic circle. The magic circle was drawn with salt. You could have just touched the it. Used the salt's texture to feel their way through the dark. I see. So Kyo traced the magic circle with his hands to get to the loose floorboard. Oh, I see. You drew the magic circle with salt to use it as a guide. Kyo's like, ooh, was that me? <laughs> Doorknob. <laughs> An interesting thought. It is unfortunate that it is so wrong. I use salt because I like a high sodium intake diet. <laughs> I haven't urinated in 18 years. Recall the document. What did the magic circle look like? Okay, I don't know. You have it memorized, bro. Would you chill? The document, the magic circle we haven't even got to the fucking the Angie part of the goddamn trial. Jesus. It makes me want to commit so terrorism. <laughs> What are you fucking waiting for, man? When the room was Go up there and seize the day. Each of us was in a corner of the room, yes? The magic circle didn't reach us, so I could not have followed it, yes? What? Wait, hold on. Uh, each of us is in the corner of the room, yes? You're talking about the magic circle in the document. 
That doesn't mean the circle you drew was the same. No, I most definitely drew it exactly the same. I have it perfectly memorized. Um, so which is it? Is there any way to check? Not anymore. The magic circle is a complete mess from being trampled on. I see. Another piece of the puzzle. Doomsgate. Doomsgate. Drawing the circle with salt. Oh, also, hello, Skuma. How's it going? Drawing the circle with salt, all but guaranteed it would be temporary. The investigation itself would have gotten rid of the evidence. Clever. Everyone, may I have your attention, please? Oh, is, do you have a recording function? Oh, what a pain. We don't have any way to check it now. God fucking damn it. Who are you, fucking Himiko? Excuse me, everyone. May I have your attention, please? Well, I guess there's no point in discussing the magic circle anymore. Hey, may I have your attention? Whoa! No, I said cut that out! It's too bright! I apologize. I just wanted everyone to listen to me. About what? <laughs> I don't know. I another function to my body, in addition to the flashlight. Yeah, what was it? <laughs> A vibrator. Not like that, I just, I just vibrate. Anyway, back to the trial. No way. Really good. I'm only 97 really? timeouts away from, ta from 1,000 timeouts. That's fucking sick. On whose channel? <laughs> you realize that you have to get to 1,000 timeouts on Lexus's channel as well, right? Oh, she's actually, actually. <laughs> We're on the same mindset, me and me. Please, let me use it. With it, I might be able to save everyone. All right, so what is this function? It's an image recording function. My channel, do it. Specifically, this function allows me to dispense a printout of my own memory. Uh-oh, that's not good. I'll give it a try. It's him taking a fucking robo-piss. Oh. From your mouth? I also use magic like that before. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. This printout is my memory of being kicked out of the sands. Please confirm that the floor of the empty room is clearly visible. Go on. Take the picture and see for yourself. We all passed it around. Okay. Got it. Oh, it's it's oh you have you have saliva. Okay, that's weird about a that a robot shouldn't have that. <laughs> the fucking I was going to stream today, but I didn't. I was going to stream on time today. <laughs> Joke of the century. <laughs> but I didn't. I saw that edited to an Uno card. <laughs> the fucking Uno reverse card. <laughs> That's actually a pretty good fucking idea. I'm gonna fucking we'll, we'll fucking steal that. So this is the magic circle used for the seance. Well, Shuichi, do you notice anything? Not really. Notice anything. <sighs> Oh, what part of my thing is more suspicious? Because uh, I think that's where Kiba was standing, right? Oh man, this is... I don't know. The area of the cage's place is suspicious. Is there really any point in paying attention to the center of the magic circle? We need to focus on the corners that are around the center, right? Damn it. Yo, what's shit me? I screwed up. They think I'm a fucking fraud. Uh, okay. Oh, uh, oh, these are all slightly different. I don't, I don't know what these are. I've got anything to do with that. Three... Ah... Uh... Uh, on top of this area here. Well, as far as I know, it looks the same as the drawing in the document. Since we're trying to find out the cover moved from the corner, maybe check there. I was wrong. He's like, bruh. He's like, bruh. Like, come on, just check the fucking corner. Is it the salt lines? Maybe, it, I don't know. Maybe it's the one the salt there. lines. Oh, I was in the corner the whole time. How come I never this got a fucking in dialogue hint? Would have seen through Keo's lie. Wait a minute. <laughs> Keo lies too? That's not fucking fair. My lie. You just said that you drew the magic circle exactly as it appears in the document. But that's a lie, isn't it? 
the magic circle at the scene had lines that stretched to the room's corners, which means that you would be able to find the floorboard from anywhere in the room. Oh. So it was different from the document after all. All because Himiko noticed. And because of Kibo, too. <laughs> Fucking damn it, this poor I robot. my thanks. I'm the one who installed that function into Kibo. Hey, yeah, what was it you were saying about its purpose? Oh, to be honest, the purpose of that image recording function is to monitor my health. Kibo use that function every day to uh, analyze my turds. <laughs>